morning, everyone. Thanks for coming in. I wasn't actually expecting so many to for breakfast, but uh, apparently everyone likes the conference and loves the food as well. Um, so I, we're going to start now um, because we have a very packed event the whole day. Uh, we've been trying to to figure out who to actually include in the the, uh, uh, the present as a speaker here, and uh, it took quite a while. Uh, but in the end, we decided to squeeze everybody together and try to get as many speakers as possible. So let me let me just quickly start. Um, my name is Sao Xiong, and um, I'm at Sao Xiong and Sao Xiong at gmail.com. So everywhere you can find me at Sao Xiong. Um, I'm the main organizer for, for this event, and I'll be your host for the day. Uh, uh, but uh, Audrey will also Audrey will be uh, doing the MC today. Uh, she's in the back. Oops. This is embarrassing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I work for a company called SP Group. Um, for those who are Sing Singaporeans or have been in Singapore before, you are probably a uh, account holder in the company. Um, SP Group used to be called Singapore Power. Uh, we are the main utility company in Singapore. Um, this slide just tells you guys about uh, my journey from Ruby, which I did quite a bit uh, a while back. I uh, wrote three books on it. And, uh, but now I am mostly stuck in this light. Uh, this light. <laughs> okay, but now I do a lot of Go now. Um, I even wrote a book and somebody just came up to me and said, hey, you know, I read your book and that felt really good. Uh, so, yes, please buy my book. <laughs> <laughs> I want to tell you a story of how we got onto this conference. Um, sometime last year in February, uh, went on two speaking uh, sort of uh, uh, conferences at the uh, in Bangalore as well as in Dubai. Um, so the bottom one was uh, the bottom one here is in, in India, and that's in India as well with Audrey, and the top one is in, in Dubai. And um, at one of the um, at the after party in Dubai, basically um, there was this thing that went around saying that uh, Aditya is Aditya here. Yeah. Hey. So uh, I was totally trolled by Aditya, and. Uh, he was saying that GoForCon Singapore is going to happen here uh, this year. Um, and a lot of people joined in, right? So that sort of became like a, a talking point during the after party. Uh, and I thought, hey, you know, why not try and do it? So I went back. Uh, yeah, I was being arrowed for this. I went back and um, I did a survey. I did a survey in March last year um, asking people whether they'd be interested in going for the conference and so on. And I got the responses, 108 responses. <clears throat> um, as you can see here, I'm not quite sure whether it's very clear or not. Uh, the responses were not ex exactly stellar. 60% um, of people say they use Go, and uh, when I asked whether anyone preferred to, uh, would like to have a workshop or not, about 40% said yes. So that was like, whoa, should we even go for this? And then I asked, are you willing to pay for it? About half the people would not pay more than $50 for this conference. Right? And uh, I was pretty depressed <laughs> after that. I was like, OK, um, I guess we can't have the conference, right? You can't have a conference, and uh, well, who's going to pay for the conference and everything? So that went on for about a few months. And uh, oops, went on for a few months. In between that, I actually changed jobs. Uh, hired a whole new team and, and everything. So that kept me pretty busy for a while. Um, and afterwards, as I was chatting with some friends and, and some people in the community, were saying, you know what? Yes, th th that's the survey, but it might not be true. Why not? Let's, let's do it. Let's give it a go. And, and so we did. So we started off this thing. Um, we rallied a bunch of people. Oops. This thing is not really working well. Um, we started off our Slack channel in October. Um, I guess I have no choice. I have to use it. And we got Dave here. He, he was the first guy who actually uh, emailed me after the conference and, and said, hey, you know what, Sao Xiong, you're going to organize this in Singapore. These are the whole list of things you, you should do. Right? I was totally bowled over by, by his passion in this. And the first person I approached to, to speak was, was Dave. Uh, so thank you, Dave. 
um, and then registered in November, the domain name. We called for volunteers in December. And I was so gung-ho that I started designing the icon, the, the logo for it, right? So I, I drew it out on my iPad and everybody showed everyone very proudly, hey, you know, should we do this? And uh, first thing the guys told me is, uh, wait, this. <laughs> no, no, it's not, not going to work, right? Uh, so we got the professionals in and uh, we designed this nice logo now that you have. <laughs> uh, I still kept the old one though. It's like, um, I look at it sometimes and say, you know, what could have been? You know? <laughs> uh, oh, this keeps jumping back and forth. So we started the, uh, the uh, call for paper in December. It took about one and a half months. We had 50 submissions. Initially, it was um, a bit shaky, but I think towards the, the mid of it, where we were going to actually uh, close, there were a lot more papers coming in. So it was good. We have 50 submissions, but of course, 50 submissions mean you have to filter uh, people, and that wasn't so good. Um, anyway, we went ahead uh, to contact our sponsors, and I don't know, AJ, is he here yet? No? So he was the first guy I contacted. Um, he's the guy who organized the, the, uh, one of the organizers in uh, Bangalore, and uh, approached him, and he was... I, at first, I approached him because I knew he joined Gojek. and said, hey, do you want to be a sponsor here? Um, do you want to be a speaker here? Sorry, do you want to be a speaker here? Ask him to be a speaker first and say, um, or if you like, you can also be a sponsor. And, and he replied to me immediately, saying, yes, we can be both, uh, without even asking how much it is, because I think at that point in time, we haven't really come up with uh, our sponsor prospectus. Um, and so I think, thank you, Gojek. And I'm not sure anyone else here from Gojek. No. But uh, there has been great supporters and the great supporters of Go. Um, so um, then we started off the, the ticket sales. And this is the chart. I spent maybe a couple hours trying to figure out how to get this on Excel, uh, but finally got it working. Um, we started out in, when was that? January 25th, 23rd. And our first ticket was sold to Sam. Is Sam here? No, he bought a first ticket and it didn't turn up. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, Sam is a great supporter as well. He's always the first guy who buys tickets. Um, <laughs> and yeah, he's, he's, he's a great guy. Uh, and then the ticket sales didn't go too well, um, but it sort of went up a bit during the end of Super Early Bird and got kind of worried. Um, to be honest, I was only expecting about 100 tickets sold because, you know, the responses and everything. And so when we went around looking for facilities, we say, look, I think about 100 will do, no, that's fine. But you know, Google came out with this great space here and said we could do 150 and more. I said, okay, I don't think we'll reach that. Maybe we'll hot enough half the, the place. You know, we have the other half for sponsors and so on. Uh, then it progressively went on. Um, and there was a spike. I was quite surprised. And um, when we updated the speakers and talks page uh, some time back, and then finally it hit 100 people and we were pretty relieved. I think we, we uh, sort of did a mini dance around the Slack channel after that. <laughs> uh, then after that, the announcements on Facebook and then uh, the ticket sales spiked. And when we ended early bird, we were about 160 odd people. And these are all paid uh, tickets, right? So that, that was pretty exciting. And then that's where we end up today. Um, so before I end up this uh, short, history of uh, the conference, the start of the conference. I want to give a shout out to all our sponsors. Gojek, of course, um, and uh, ThoughtWorks, who have a booth at the behind. Uh, they were the second sponsors to be in. Uh, and then, of course, uh, my company, SP Group. Uh, my boss was very, very supportive. He has no idea what I'm doing, but he's still very supportive. Uh, Standard Chartered, Jim, Jim Dolphin, who is not here, but uh, this booth is here. And uh, a whole bunch of other people who, who jump in as well and said they will contribute. Um, a lot of them, um, came in towards the end, but I think uh, it, was, it was great support from the community. And of course, uh, Google as well for providing this great space. We have a lot of speakers today. Um, try to squeeze in as many people as possible. We went through all the talks and uh, we were very, very excited to, to uh, read about all the talks and uh, uh, hopefully we will have a great day today. So 
I end up saying that um, please enjoy all the talks, but most importantly, enjoy the company of the people around you. I think this is a Go community uh, in Southeast Asia, our first conference here. I hope you have a great day ahead. Thank you.